Since it's the publication day for Brad Thor's latest book, Near Dark, I thought I'd do a throwback book review on his very first debut, The Lines of Lucerne. And as you can see, what a absolutely cool book cover. It's just awesome. <laughs> wouldn't, you, wouldn't you agree, folks? Now, the plot is, while the president is taking a skiing vacation with his daughter, a group of Swiss, a group of mercenaries attack, wiping nearly all of his Secret Service detail and kidnap and kidnap in and kidnapping the president. But there is a survivor, one Secret Service agent named Scott Harbath, who was a former Navy SEAL. Now, it's up to Scott Harvath to rescue the president and find out who was framing him. He's also up against a lethal cabal of conspirators. Now, this is, to me, is what I call an awesome novel. It's got great characters, awesome bad guys, a lot of cool, fantastic action sequences, and a lot of mountain climbing scenes, which, which surprisingly um, also reminded me of Cliffhanger and compelled me to check that movie out again, which, which I really enjoy. This is one of the... This is sort of like a really, really awesome debut. Why Breath was the king of faction... Why he's awesome to follow on social media. And why he's had like an awesome streak of great novels. You gotta read the book series. It's a it's a it's a must in my view. Well, thank you for checking out my book review, and I'm wishing Brad Thor if he ever sees this, I'm not sure. Happy publication day. Bye.